What's going on everybody? Welcome to Always Occupied Home and Product Reviews and in today's review we have the Heart Hybrid Battery or Cord 20 volt system 12 inch fan. This is a 12 inch battery powered fan. As they said you can use a cord is hybrid so battery plus your 120 volts of power. It says right here 20 volts at 2 amps give you 4 hours of run time. Now you may just be working in your garage or you might just be doing some work doing construction work or you might just be in the family room, living room, dining room, wherever you at and you want to be portable. This is a perfect fan, at least I think so. I will let y'all know how good it blows once I have it out the box. I was in Home Depot. I was looking for the Ryobi fan. And basically, for me, I think it's priced out. Uh, the 18 inch is like $160. But there's another Ryobi that was on the Ryobi Dave sale for $100, but you get two batteries and you get the charger. So, and then they have the real, real, real cheap one, which was like 40 bucks or something like that. I was browsing in Walmart and I just saw this one for a whopping 60 bucks. Now, this one is tool only. Battery and charger are not included. So luckily for us, we have a battery and we have a charger because we like heart tools too. I think heart tools is going to be my second go-to besides Ryobi. Let's go ahead and open the box and check this fan out. As usual, we have instructions. Whew, being 12 inches is pretty big. All right, we have the fan. And I can honestly say, here, this is another reason why I am attracted to heart. I actually like the colors. The black, blue, white, I love the colors. Just like Ryobi, I love the colors. We have a power cord right here. This is hybrid, so if you want this to run for four hours on your fully charged battery, it's gonna run four hours. If you want it to run forever, and ever here goes your power cord all right you guys so do we really need instructions no <laughs> ah, okay so right here as a matter of fact let me get y'all a little closer see how quick that was okay you guys so right here is your battery and then came on automatically. Somebody already had it set on three, probably while it was testing. So the first knob all the way on the corner to the right is the lowest. I think that's like a standard. So that's the lowest. Now it's, I don't know, maybe it might be a little loud for y'all. I can't really tell if y'all can tell that much, but for me, it sounds like a regular fan going off. There is no quietness to it. Um, you know, like those tower fans, the tower fans are pretty quiet. But the oscillating fans are usually uh, have a pretty much a high sound on it. Level two. Level three. And then off. You can grab it from the top. I'll back up a little bit. All right, so you can grab it from the top right here has a open slot. So it's easy to grab, very portable, pretty cool. If you want to know how to use your power cord, take the battery off and then right here is a slot. So the base you are looking at 13 inches. Y'all see the bottom? So it's basically like a triangle, but I'll give y'all the depth. Would be about 10 inches. 
Okay, you guys, so this thing, if you loosen the sides on here, it tilts. So it tilts all the way up. And also, it tilts down a rough 10 foot of extension cord they give you. I know they're going to ask for this one in the comments. I feel it. I feel it coming. How long is the cord? Okay, you guys. And another thing that I have for y'all. One last thing. This fan can be mounted on the wall. Uh, right there. Do you see it? Got a spot for a screw here, spot for a screw there. And also a tip that I'm going to give y'all that y'all really, 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 really need to know. Do not mount this on straight drywall. Make sure you find the stud. Use a stud finder. Don't just put the screw in the drywall and put this up. You will damage your product. Okay, you guys, so I am about to hang up the heart fan and one last time there's two ways you can hang this you can measure from one point to the other point and I got three inches when I actually measured it it also tells you right here it says right there three inches from that point to that point and I also did a video when I hung my mirror that's in my bathroom I hung the mirror that's in the bathroom and I use painter's tape. So check out that video if you want another method of hanging stuff. I didn't put no level on this. This is just a regular wall. I'm in my storage area. I can do whatever I want in here. And we are going to hang this heart fan and hopefully it goes well. Hopefully I don't fail and that's it. It's on. Okay, so we have the fan, we have the battery on, and just a note to y'all, don't put it too high because the, to install the battery and the cord, you have to reach up. So if you put it higher than your reach, you will need to get a step stool to unhook the battery. Y'all can see from there if it wobbles too much if I turn it on high. There's no wobble. So, everything is working pretty good. I'm gonna put it on two. I got it on the lowest setting now, so hopefully y'all can hear me pretty good. So there you go. If you want to be under the fan, or if you want your chair under this fan, you can set your chair right here. If you got like an outside setup, you can put like a, a, a four by four, on uh, like a bucket of concrete and have a cool fan blowing on you on the nice spring days or summer days or however you want to do it. This is not waterproof, so don't keep it outside. <laughs> oh, you will be mad. That is the review of the Heart 12 inch fan hybrid. I hope you like it. Um, if you like this review, leave a like. If you have any questions about the product, please drop it in the comment section below and I will try to get to you as quick as possible. I'll try, try. Sometimes I don't get there that quick, but I'll get to you as quick as possible. If you want to see more cool products, something like this or many more products that I got on the channel, hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you can be notified. And I'll catch y'all in the next video.